This is going to be a brief video on over-the-air antennas, uh, digital over-the-air antennas. This frame that you're looking at is of a Philips branded over-the-air antenna and as you can see it's a very narrow profile. There's just a black coaxial cable connector and there's some of the plastic mounting hardware and this particular antenna is secured to a satellite antenna post and just uh, pulling back here you can see it's quite low to the ground and if you're curious that white plastic pipe is purely to protect the black coaxial cable from a weed whacker and again the only connection is the black coaxial cable this particular antenna is directed, pointed in the direction of the broadcasters. Uh, it's not the most optimal installation, but it does work. It's not optimal because there are obstructions, uh, such as a uh, house and a few trees that are separating the broadcasters from this antenna, but the antenna does pick up signals. It picks up signals from about eight to ten stations and we'll demonstrate that later in the video um, there are better antennas and when I say better antennas which pick up more channels that are broadcast from farther distances this antenna is picking up broadcasters that are uh, as far away as 50 miles away uh, normally you would want the antenna a bit higher up and uh, fewer obstructions but for this application for emergency purposes this one works well another antenna that I'm gonna show with my hand this is a store-bought it's rabbit ears and you can see the old-style antenna leads sticking out and they move around just like the old-style rabbit ears it's got a bit of a funky design and on the back is just a single cable connector which would go to an appropriate connector on the back of your TV, preferably a flat screen TV. Now if it's an old style television, you know, the big deep ones, then you have to have a uh, tuner. Now that knob right there is a little gain control. It helps you bring the signal in a little stronger or tune it down so it's a little weaker. When you make the signal stronger, the picture does uh, distort, and when you make it weaker, the picture will pixelate or go away. We arrived at our campsite in Fox. Okay, I just muted the picture, and you're looking at NBC on my cable television. It's in high definition, and it's in high definition because my local cable provider rebroadcasts the high definition content. The signal comes in as what is called a clear qualm signal. There's no set-top box required to view this. So now I'm going to switch to the over-air antenna and I'm going to press the antenna button on my remote control. And there it's switching to antenna and I'm going to unmute it. Maybe we had to get our nails a little dirty making s'mores by the campfire. Okay, I'm going to mute it again. So now we are watching over-the-air television and I'm going to show you a benefit of over the air because I'm going to go up one channel. Now I'm on channel 15.2 and that is a local satellite weather channel that's on 24-7. Back to NBC over the air. So this is free. You just need an over the air antenna hooked up to a television that has the correct tuner in it. If you have one of those really large boxed televisions, then you need a converter. But if you have a flat screen, the tuner is already built in.